There's an invisible war being waged every day, not with weapons, but with wills. The aggressors, energy vampires. These unseen predators feed not on flesh, but on the vibrance of your soul. Quiet and often unnoticed, they squeeze the joy, clarity and vitality from our lives, leaving us drained and disconnected. Without firing a single shot, they manage to conquer territories of our psyche, to drain us of our life force energy that is the very essence of our being. This battle isn't fought on distant lands or in shadowy alleyways, but right where you are, in bustling cafes, on social media, even within the sanctum of your home. Your opponents are not supernatural beings, but real people, friends, family, lovers, colleagues, people who knowingly or unknowingly become energy vampires, absorbing your positive energy and spewing back negativity. The ramifications of their energetic pilfering are not insignificant. Day after day, these draining engagements can lead to persistent exhaustion, an omnipresent cloud of negativity, and a gnawing sense of imbalance that taints our joys and saps our spirit. Like a once bright and vibrant painting left to fade under harsh light, we begin to dull under their persistent pull. Yet this diurnal tug of war need not remain a part of our lives. Recognition of these energy vampires and understanding their modus operandi is the very first step in reclaiming the battlefields of our energy. It's high time this unseen war is seen for what it truly is, an insidious infiltration of our personal and spiritual spaces. Together, on this journey of understanding and self-discovery, we will illuminate the shadows. We will expose these stealthy predators and, most importantly, learn to guard our energy, resilience and inner peace. Perhaps you felt it breathe down your neck, the chilly gust of an energy vampire. Within this metaphysical concept lies a vivacious enigma that may have, knowingly or unknowingly, invaded the serenity of your life. They're not so mythical fangs, etched with behaviors and words that drain, invisibly puncture your emotional well-being, leaving you feeling spent. An encounter with an energy vampire can often leave you feeling emotionally depleted. They latch onto your energy, thrive on the glow of your life force, and leave you feeling drained. Imagine the fulgent flame of a candle, its vibrancy and light steadily diminishing not due to the natural passage of time, but an external force. That force is the energy vampire in your life. These individuals are not marked by outwardly ominous traits, but by their constant negativity, unrelenting neediness and chronic complaining. They color every interaction with their personal concerns, spreading clouds of negativity and siphoning the positive energy from your emotional construct. What's more, if you find yourself often understanding and emotionally tuning into those around you, that empathic trait of yours might be making you an attractive prey. Your ability to understand and absorb emotions often leaves you vulnerable to these energy vampires. Your light, your positivity, becomes their banquet, consumed and craved. Furthermore, it isn't just the archetypical energy vampire you might need to be wary of. Narcissistic personalities can often express similar energy-draining traits. Thriving on your empathy, they manipulate and drain you to fulfill their own emotional needs. This leads us to another facet of our understanding, the intersection between energy vampires and narcissistic abuse. Imagine standing alone on a stage in a grand auditorium. The lights are shining bright, the audience expectant. You have a golden voice, one capable of melting hearts, and you've prepared to share the melodies within you. However, there's a seemingly familiar face in the audience, a narcissistic abuser. As you start to sing, they begin to clap, drowning out your voice with their applause. They demand attention, command applause, deflate your energy till you're no longer singing but echoing their praises instead. 
This analogy captures the alarmingly deceptive and energy-draining tactics employed by narcissistic individuals. Their methods are often opaquely duplicitous and emotionally charged. They lurk within the intricacies of our emotional fabric, unraveling us strand by strand. Their hallmarks are control and manipulation, laden with damage most profound, emotional and psychological. Gaslighting is often their favorite tool. They manipulate your reality to a point that you start doubting your own sanity. They might contradict factual events or deny their previous statements, convoluting reality until you question your own memory. Your mental energy becomes a buffet as they insist on their reality, taking away your trust in your perceptions and judgments. They are exceptional at love bombing, a technique marked with excessive admiration, intense affection and attention at the beginning of a relationship, only to swiftly shift gears once they have you entrapped. Belittling your feelings and achievements is another tactic, reducing your enthusiasm to ashes and ensuring your emotional wealth is drained. By managing to shadow your accomplishments, they casually erode your self-worth and confidence, casting your ambitions and success in their corrosive, narcissistic shadow. Divide and rule is another manipulative strategy. They may intentionally isolate you from your beloved ones, painting themselves as your sole ally. As you grow emotionally reliant on them, they feed off the energy your isolation provides. Then they engage in the victim-blaming dance. You're always at fault in every argument or discussion. Your feelings become bait for self-affirmation. Your laments answered by allegations, effectively making you feel guilty for their misbehavior. The idealization discard cycle fleshes out their manipulative behaviors. After placing you on an idealistic pedestal, they relish in your fall. And once your energy has been pillaged, you are dismissed, tossed apart like an empty vessel. The modus operandi is overwhelmingly damaging, leaving casualties not in bodies but in broken spirits, depleted energy levels and severely impaired psyches. All while they flourish in the turmoil, their narcissism nourished with every drop of emotional energy they manage to extract. It's an interaction characterized by abuse, control and most significantly, a severe drainage of your emotional vitality. Understanding these maneuvers forms a crucial line of defense to safeguard against such manipulation and the resulting emotional exhaustion. While navigating this labyrinth of energy, vampires and narcissistic abusers can feel daunting. Hold fast to the power that resides within you. You hold a more potent weapon, an empowered self, swathed in the armor of self-awareness, boundaried interactions and empathic shielding. Let's start by understanding empathic shielding, a protective barrier that one consciously creates to ward off the encroachment of negative energies. If you're naturally empathetic, you are susceptible to the absorption of emotions and energies around you. However, you can learn to regulate this capacity. Imagine an invisible shield around you, an ethereal cocoon that filters incoming energies. This mental construct allows positive vibes to enter while reflecting away unfavorable ones. The more you practice, the more intuitive and effective this process gets. Setting emotional boundaries is another powerful tool. Firm boundaries are the pillars that uphold your mental health and energy levels. Begin with asserting your right to differentiating yourself from others. Your emotions, needs and decisions are your own distinct from others. When interacting energetically, be it sharing joys or consoling a friend, ensure it doesn't drain you. Balance empathy with self-care. Remember you are not responsible for someone else's emotions or reactions. Practicing mindfulness can also serve as a healing salve. This technique tasks you with being wholly present in each moment without judgment or distraction. As you become more aware of your thoughts, feelings and physical sensations, you empower yourself to recognize subtle shifts in your energy when encountering potential energy vampires or narcissists. 
This sharpness of mind can act as an early warning system, enabling you to react proactively. Self-love and self-care, though seemingly trivial, are key armor elements against negativity. Fueling yourself with positive affirmations, maintaining a healthy lifestyle, practicing regular emotional check-ins, all contribute to a stronger, more resilient self. When you prioritize your mental and emotional well-being, you effectively secure your energy from being siphoned by external negative influences. Finally, seek professional help if needed. Therapists and counselors are equipped to provide strategies and coping mechanisms for those struggling under incessant negative emotional engagements. Your well-being, self-esteem, and emotional balance are not mere prerogatives, but rights. Assert them. While these techniques do not eliminate the existence of energy vampires or narcissistic abusers, they do equip you to better manage your interactions with them. Do remember, it's your power, your energy. Protect it, shield it, and most importantly, own it. You are not just a survivor, but a warrior in this constant tug of war of energies. Stand stellared in your space and let your energy shine unfettered and undiminished. In the rich tapestry of life, challenges like energy vampires and narcissistic abusers can't be avoided. Yet, with tools of empathic shielding, emotional boundaries, mindfulness, self-love and professional guidance, you are well equipped to face and mitigate these obstacles. Remember, you possess the profound capacity to protect your energy and fortify your emotional fortress. It is your journey, your resolution, that guides you through the murky corners and sunlit hills of your sojourn. You, with your remarkable resilience, have the power to illuminate the shadowed paths, uplifting not only yourself, but those who walk on this path alongside you. If this exploration enriched your understanding or reaffirmed your strategy against emotional and energetic drain, please give us a like and share this knowledge with those who might be in dire need of it. Encourage them to sharpen their awareness and join our empowering journey. Together, we can thrive on the fascinating crossroads of science, spirituality and self-awareness. Subscribe to Sage Snippets and join our vibrant community. Connect with fellow seekers and let the wisdom and serenity of ancient practices blend seamlessly with contemporary scientific insights. Together, we can create a space that champions growth, wellness and transformation as we delve into life's exciting, mysterious and mind-expanding aspects. As you continue your journey, remember to hold fast to your precious, vibrant energy, radiate your light, and when needed, remind yourself, I am peace, I am light, my energy is my own. Until our next sage snippet, continue to thrive, continue to shine, and most importantly, continue to be you. Namaste.